It's tough to think about. Adult sexual assault, rape by any other definition, is a much more common crime than most people realize. And yet, it is one of the most unreported crimes. The numbers are shocking. In Texas, only 9% of all sexual assaults are reported to law enforcement. Why would a crime victim, a victim of rape, not report it? And let me suggest it's because, as a society, we always tell women um, it matters where you go, what you do, how you dress. And, and part of that is getting women to this mindset that they must have done something wrong for this to happen. After a long history of these crimes being ignored by the state, Tarrant County Criminal District Attorney Sharon Wilson has made prosecuting adult sexual assault a priority, creating a special unit of lawyers to focus on these violent and most intimate crimes. I was very excited to be able to be part of the adult sexual assault unit from the very beginning because the creation of it, I think, is a, a very big statement in our office that we're going to take these cases very seriously. Adult sexual assaults are incredibly hard to prosecute. Um, there's so many myths associated with what we expect a victim to act like. There's myths of what we expect a defendant to look like. Kim Davignon so, is chief of the adult sexual assault um, unit and says the toughest challenge in trial is to get the jury over preconceived notions about rape victims. When we believe this idea that they must be wearing this super short skirt or acting a certain way or, or if they were terribly drunk, what's really offensive about that is it kind of includes this idea that somehow men are activated into raping someone because of something the victim's doing. Well, that's terrible and that's not true. The reality is most women are raped wearing jeans, sweatpants, because they're around someone they know and they feel comfortable with. That's the reality of sexual assault. Another major myth prosecutors struggle with is the jury's notion of the kind of person who commits these crimes. We as a society have this idea of what a rapist looks like, right? Like they're the guy hiding in the bushes in a trench coat with a knife, right? Like that's what a rape has to be for a victim to be believed. The truth is, most people are raped by someone they know. The U.S. Justice Department reports that 80 percent, that's eight out of ten women who are raped, know their attacker. There's, there's not one face of evil. You know, sometimes evil is tall, dark, and handsome. Um, and so kind of overcoming the perceptions of, of um, sex assault and having to convince people that, that evil exists, that creates a lot of problems. And so does getting the victim to trust the prosecutors. I think that probably the most important thing for the victim of an adult sexual assault case is that they need to know that we believe them. We have a chance to radically change the way people perceive sexual assault because people are going to sit down at kitchen tables and they're going to tell their mothers and their brothers and their sisters and their fathers what happened to them. The people around you are confronted with the reality of sexual assault. They're confronted with that the myths that they believed maybe weren't true because they weren't true for their loved one. And that's how things change. See the resources available to victims of adult sexual assault on the Tarrant County Criminal District Attorney website, cda.tarrantcounty.com.